if you are a researcher and using AI tools for research writings, let me ask one question to you. Does your workflow of writing any research document with AI tools look like this? It means you are depending on multiple AI tools for your academic writing, for finding the research gap, writing with the help of AI tools and then for editing and proofreading, reference management and so on and so on. This is not only a frustrating, this is expensive too and a huge barrier between a smooth and productive workflow. And today's tool is the solution. I'm talking about Answer This AIO and in this video, I'm going to go through step by step. So stuck with me because this is going to solve all the problems which you are facing while writing your research document and how this tool can help you with professional document in hand. You can access the tool from the link available in description. Access the tool, you will see this kind of interface. Here is the search bar where you can enter the query and find the results accordingly. Before moving there, these are some few best features which Answer This AI is offering for researchers like writing the literature, uh, searching papers and building a citation map. Not only this, it also allows you to chat with PDF, to write with AI, to extract data and extract information from a huge set of papers and to generate very professional academic diagrams and workflows. And its popular tools are Neutralizer, AI essay writer, research gap finder and AI paraphraser tool. So we are going to have a quick look on all the prominent features of Answer This AIO and I'm going to show you that how you can take benefit from them in less time. For example, we want to find a research gap in a specific research query and based on that research gap, we are going to build the whole structure of our research document and the research we are going to conduct. There are multiple ways that uh, Answer This AI is going to help you to find a research gap. It can be based upon research area it can be based on specific methodologies or you can look at interdisciplinary research gap for example if i want to know about the methodological gaps i will feed the tool to identify significant methodological research gap in climate change science a focus on areas where current quantitative models data analysis techniques or experimental designs are inadequate for example what are the limitations of current global uh, circulations and what novel approaches like machine learning ai or complex systems theory could provide a breakthrough. Even you can take the help of ChatGPT or Google AI Studio to create some specific research gap based questions which you can ask to answer this AIO to get the appropriate answer in less time with less effort. So the response you will get will be backed with the strong references and you will get a list of references on the right side of the tool. For example, certainly here is the detail. This is identifying a significant methodology research gap in climate change science. We will repeat our query limitations on current methods, resolution and regional specific, GMS computational demand and this is the whole research gap which is backed by a solid reasoning and the strong literature. Then gap in data analysis, experimental design and observational network in the same way breakthrough emerging solutions and enhance predictive power, big data and re-collaboration. You can see a detailed sector and impact specific gaps, summary of table gaps causes and promise approaches and uh here you can see the list of the references and you can simply download this uh, in the form of a pdf or you can share this with any or you can add it with ai you can copy this and make your own document so in the same way you can ask for methodological sociological geographical gaps and answer this ai will provide you a complete document based on those research gaps back with strong literature now as you can see you can search the paper and for that purpose you have to click on the search papers option and you will come up with this interface where you have to enter the query so, for example, my title is a machine learning framework for reducing uncertainty in long-term climate tipping point projection. As you can see, this is long-term forecasting framework for renewable energy techniques. You will see the list of related papers and here you can put the filter. For example, you want to sort by date or sort by citations or you want to have all the papers with available PDFs only. You want to extract the data and by just clicking on that, some options will pop up which will suggest to you that which part of the paper you want to focus on to extract the data and you will get all the related information here under each paper. Even you can chat with the selected papers. You can export this in the form of a CSV or WebTix file and build your own library just by clicking on the selected paper and by clicking on save to library. In this way, you will be able to build your own library. You, even you can upload your own selection of the 
paper you want to keep in in your research writing and want to consider them while writing your search document and you just have to click on the upload and and in this way you will be able to upload your own collection and will be able to set the information from those papers not only this it's a citation map feature will allows you to search by paper title so for example uh, we are going to search by paper title or enter doi so for example we are going to enter the name of the paper which is available in our library and we will uh, select this or set it as the origin or as a seed paper and this will allow us to um, bring a citation map in front of us which research rabbit and connected paper was doing for you and answer this ai is offering this feature in front of you so you will be able so just just by providing a one single seed paper its citation map feature will allows you to find all the related papers regarding that specific queries in a single click and these all papers you can consider them while building your library or while writing your research document so for example uh, so just by clicking on that specific paper that paper will pop up on the top and you can set it as origin or can save in your library or you can copy the abstract if you set it as origin it means you want to explore more papers like that and you want to expand this site map in this way uh, you will be able to extract the information and to build up your library for your next step of writing your research document so for example we will go on ai write and at this stage you have to enter the title of your document and have to press on new document and we'll click on create document after providing the complete description of your research topic which will include the research problem and research question and all the important details which you have mentioned in your research proposal you can build the headings and subheadings the entire outline the complete outline of your research of your research document and it's better approach to go chapter wise instead of developing the outline of entire research document in one go for example you want uh, six headings and each heading should contain two subheadings we just customizing the options here you will press on generate outline and as you can see on the right side you will develop the full outline by answer io you can edit you can build the library you can search the paper so here is the entire outline of the document which have been generated and after going through the outline i will press on apply outline and you can see that uh, this is the outline of the introduction to the climate tipping points and uncertainty and you can see the headings and subheadings and the further details which have to be covered under each subheading and you will see the list of references even which have been considered while building this outline as you can see uh, answer this ai is not doing all the writing processes on a single click it's taking us uh, by following the step by step process which is required to build a critical well structured authentic research document which you can defend in front of any jury that how you collect the information how you build the outline from where you get the data and you have a full control on your research document so for example you want to write and for writing you have to click on the heading and after that you can use two options either you can use expand outline or you can customize the prompt so for example if i want to go with this it's by I will uh, expand. I will press on expand, or I can customize this prompt and can use some other keywords also to make the provided information more accurate. As you can see, on a single click, I get all these related information, which should to be covered at the introduction part of my document. Climate tipping points refer to a critical threshold in climate system where a small perturbation can lead to a significant and often irreversible change in a system's data academic tone of this the academic tone the opening and the structure of the information is is quite promising and this is can be used in any kind of a research document and we can expand the remaining headings in the same way just by clicking on them and even if i'm not uh, very much satisfied with this specific part i can use it rephrase the option to rephrase this specific part after rephrasing and making it uh, more academic i can even use its ai edit feature to edit the document working with the selected text so uh, what i have to do after selecting the text and cl clicking ai edit these some options will appear either i want to reword it summarize it generate the questions or i want a custom prompt so for example i want to summarize it so would you like answer this ai to search for new sources either i want to add some more references in it so 
enter the topic which you like to find new sources about. So I have to enter the point, for example, definition of climate tipping points and then I will press on generate. So in this way, its AI edit feature will help me to enhance the quality of the references to enhance the quality of the document which answer this AI right for me. I can resize it, I can summarize it, I can expand it, I can add more references, I can make any change which I want just by using its AI edit feature. So as you can see, uh, this is the new document, insert before, insert after, or you want to replace the selection. So I want to replace this. As you can see, some more references have been added in this. Just by providing the email address of the person I want to share with it, I can share the live document with this. And for example, I want to share it with me. I will add, I will send the invitation. And here you can see, I have received the information invitation on my email just by accepting the invitation and log Again, with, with the doc, your supervisor, your mentor will be able to review your document by staying on the same interface. So you can access the tool from the link available in the description where you will also find a discount code and some free credits to explore this tool in free. If you found it useful, don't forget to share this tool and this video with others. And if you have any query, feel free to ask in the comment section. I will see you in another video. Till then, take care of yourself. Bye-bye.